if everyday low prices and quality products matter to you, then come to Consulates on Bush Road, number 72, St. Martin. At Consulates, you can buy the highest quality food and household products, frozen foods, dairy products, snacks, laundry and cleaning products, housewares, and just about every other thing under the sun. Our customer service is just simply the best. St. Kitts Nevis shoppers, visit www.costyouless.com or visit our store on St. Martin and we'll help you ship your items. Cost you less, your best value warehouse store. Antigua and Barbuda, St. Kitts and Nevis, Anguilla and Montserrat are islands that are this hour under a hurricane warning. The late advisories issued at 11 a.m. Monday, Guadeloupe was also issued with a hurricane watch and Dominican Republic a tropical storm watch. The U.S. Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico have also been issued with hurricane watches. The hurricane now, with maximum sustained winds of 120 miles an hour, is expected to affect the islands later Tuesday. Additional strengthening is also forecasted. Hurricane force winds extend outward up to 35 miles from the center, and tropical storm force winds extend outward up to 140 miles. A storm surge warning is also in effect. Forecasters say the combination of a dangerous storm surge and large breaking waves will raise water levels by as much as 6 to 9 feet above normal tide levels along the coast of extreme northern Leeward Islands within the hurricane warning area. Meantime, Antigua's Prime Minister Gaston Brown urged people to take preventative measures in case the tropical storm should keep on its current arc, saying that should include cleaning drains and removing objects that could be sent flying by high winds. Workers began pruning trees and shrubs to reduce chances for branches to tear down power and phone lines. In St. Kitts and Nevis, Deputy Prime Minister Sean Richards urged residents there to take the warnings seriously. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.